M0FXB Hamtech, welcome to my channel. So this is the latest beta version of Pi-Star. I thought I'd just plug in the HDMI out cable straight into this PC monitor just to see what happens. And yes, it, it can run M17 and it's been upgraded to be able to run some of the newer versions of, of Raspberry. But it's still in development process or stage, should I say. Now it says here, that if I want to access my hotspot, it says the dashboard can be found at it's given these different addresses. Pi-star, Pi-star local, and then you've got that IP address. But also, we've given, it says here, Pi with onboard Wi-Fi. You can connect to either the Pi-star or Pi-star setup access point, and it's given a different IP address. So I'm gonna try that address and see what happens. Or we can just log in now uh, using the usual Pi Star and Raspberry. I just thought I'd show you, still experimenting and, and why we, I'm learning. So let's see what happens. Yeah, those addresses are taking me to the, the Pi Star dashboard that you, you would expect. Sorry about the notifications. Let's log in. To use a keyboard, I just plug in an extra, an extra connector to the micro, mini micro USB adapter as you can see and then goes to my keyboard just a Dell keyboard it's interesting watching it boot up you get all this information pretty cool and once you put the Pi Star and Raspberry login this is where you where you get to okay and it does say Pi Star disk is read only by default. Enable read write by typing in RPI RW. Pi Star built by Andy Taylor, MW0, MWZ, Pi Star Tools, or start Pi Star. Thanks very much, Andy Taylor. Enjoying the updates. Bye for now, 7 3.